So this suit's a little bit different than the suits of uh, kind of today that's used on the space station. So this is called a rear entry design or a back entry design. This hatch would open up. Um, you would put your feet in, put your arms in, and, and kind of shimmy down into the suit. And then we would close the hatch. The light band is mounted to the visor assembly into the helmet bubble. Uh, and this, this essentially gives the astronauts lights to see where they're in shaded portions of the moon or if they're in low Earth orbit in a night pass, they can turn on these lights to see um, using tools or translating on the space station or anything like that. We also have on the side here, we have a HD video camera. So those of us back on Spaceship Earth watching the EVA, uh, we'll be able to watch it in high definition, which will be a fantastic upgrade, I think, from, <clears throat> from current day technology. All of this is mounted on the helmet bubble. Um, which is amounted to what we call in this configuration of our suit, the hard upper torso. So the hard upper torso goes roughly from Jim's waist up to the top. And uh, this is kind of the core structure of the suit. It's what we attach everything to. One of the differences between this suit and the suit that will be on the moon is that it will, the moon suit will mostly be white. So we'll replace all the black with white. And that's really for thermal reasons. So didn't want anybody to, to get that mixed up. Um, but other than that, I think this is just a fantastic, fantastic looking suit.